a tease of Aleppo Museum Trump. After nearly 24 hours of drenching rain helped quench a series of devastating wildfires in eastern Tennessee, local officials turned to cleanup and recovery efforts even as they battled their own personal crises. 5.50 p.m. Vice President-elect Mike Pence says he is eager to work with Congress to move forward on President-elect Donald Trump's agenda to get this economy moving again, rebuild our military and keep the promises that Trump made to the American people. In another series of tweets Monday, he lashed out at a CNN reporter who had called Trump's fraud claim baseless. The Lebanese Almana TV channel reported from the Aleppo countryside that pro-government forces were advancing in the southern portion of the city's rebel enclave. 10.15 p.m. The UN humanitarian chief says that the laws of war have been systematically disregarded in the besieged Syrian city of Aleppo. 5.35 p.m. Air Conditioning Company Carrier Corp. says an agreement to keep jobs in Indianapolis was doable because President-elect Donald Trump has promised to create an improved, more competitive U.S. business climate. Other top Trump allies, notably campaign manager Kellyanne Conway, have launched a highly unusual public campaign to warn the President-elect that nominating Romney would be seen as a betrayal by his supporters. Thanks for viewing this tease. Sign up for the Tip Top Tech channel or search for a tease second mind on YouTube to find and then enjoy other teas.